I love that. I love that for me. Hi babes, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Obviously you've read the title above and this is a San Diego road trip with Rumi. We're already here in California. I haven't vlogged too, too much because we actually came to LA first to visit her family and now we're finally heading to San Diego. Hey Rumi. And we're gonna go on a hike. If you're not following me on Instagram, you would not know I'm doing a seven day move your body challenge. And basically for these last seven days, the goal was to move your body for at least 30 minutes in any exercise that you like, just for seven days straight. So today's day six, obviously I'm in California, so we need to be moving our body and we're going to go to Torrey Pines, we're gonna go hike. So we're gonna head there right now. So if you would like to see what we get into on this road trip, then just keep watching. You guys, we finally made it to the beach. It is so beautiful and now we're about to hike and it's all the way straight up. So, my heart's gonna be pounding. We're getting our body moving. Let's do the damn thing. Me and Rumi, Rumi Ting's back at it again. <laughs> this time we are at the beach on our beach adventure. It is seriously so gorgeous, you guys. We've already seen a squirrel that like came up to us. We saw a hummingbird. That's it, actually. I thought we saw more. She said we saw all these animals, all these creatures. <laughs> we saw all these things we don't see in Arizona. That's so weak. you're so funny. <laughs> Whew. Me and Romy getting a sweat on, busting a sweat. It's definitely different hiking in California versus Arizona because we're literally on like a road. And then it finally like breaks off into this little trail. No, it doesn't. Just kidding, no it doesn't. <laughs> Us not knowing where the hell to go. In Arizona, it's literally all desert. You're like you just get on the trail and you just get deeper and deeper into the desert. <gasps> Me trying to catch my breath. High point overlook. We're trying to find the point where we can basically just Don't give me be in, on the man. beach. Oh, sorry, Rumi. So Girl, I'm hot and ugly too. We I both hot and ugly you together. You are okay with being hot and ugly on camera. I definitely am not. <laughs> okay. Rumi doesn't want to be hot and ugly on camera, but I will be hot and ugly for you guys. You guys, how crazy is it that this used to all literally be underwater? Like fact it's from Danielle. Roomy fact, she says. Oh, this is so beautiful. We're about to walk down a hundred steps. My shoe's wet and my babe sign is gone. <laughs> uh, no, they're just a little wet. Fail. Just trying to be cute for you, babes. Trying to be cute for you, babes. And what happens? The beach just, the sun just shines on me. It's so beautiful. <sighs> We finally made it down here. 
and it is so, so beautiful, you guys. beach sounds amazing but it's so much harder because obviously my body's going down into the sand and I am having a harder time holding myself up but I was able to get both of my legs up for a, for a second so that was cool. Hey Rumi. <laughs> Rumi teams. <laughs> As I just eat a mouthful of hair. Me trying to be romantic with Rumi and just Okay, babe, so obviously we are finally back home and I am the worst vlogger ever and I did not vlog damn near anything other than the hike, which was so awesome, super gorgeous. We both freaking loved it, but I figured we would hop on, kind of catch you up on our weekend. Um, we do have a little story time of what went down on day one of being in LA. So Danielle and I decide so we go out to the bars in LA. We've never been to LA, um, like to the, the bars. We don't really know what the scene is. So we just go to this random bar. It's pretty fun. We're kind of like making friends with people and we're having a few drinks. So we decide, you know what, let's go dance. The music's pretty good. So we go on the dance floor and me and her are, like dancing together. And this guy is like chilling. He's kind of watching us, <laughs> kind of creepy. And he asks us, hey, can I dance with you? And I kind of like look at her and I'm like, oh, we're together. And he's like, oh, can I dance with you guys? I'm like, we're together together. <laughs> and so this, this motherfucker says, oh, that's okay. I'm gay too. And me and her just look at each other like, what? And in the same instance of like basically us kind of shook that this guy is still trying after we're like clearly telling him no, there's a pissed off woman coming through the crowd. Like a, uh, like a, a rhino. She was like a like, rhino. Or not not saying that's what she looked like, but she was coming in hot. That's how hot she was coming like in, a yeah. Pissed rhino. She was she was mad and she was uh, apparently mad at us, even though we were literally trying to like flea flick this guy away. He was a flea flicker. You know, when you have a flea, you need to flick them, you need to get them away, they need to be gone. Mm -hmm. That's a flea flicker. Mm -hmm. So this little flea flicker, his girlfriend, is now rhinoing through the crowd of people and looks at me and grabs her drink and splashes it all on the side of my face and my ears, my hair, and my instant reaction, and the glass hits the floor, busts everywhere. My instant reaction is I turn around and I walk down the hall so quick to avoid it. This one. On the other hand, is like, what did you end up saying to her? No, I yelled at her. I yelled at her for like, well, pretty much because she had said that when she came up, she said, that's my boyfriend. And I had said pretty much like, what the fuck, bitch? I'm just kidding. But pretty much, <laughs> no, yeah, literally. I did, I did literally, pretty though. Much tell her, like, what the fuck? What's your problem? And then she had said, that's my boyfriend. And I said, nobody's trying to get with your fucking boyfriend. And then that's when her apology started coming in of, oh, I'm sorry. I know, I know. And I just pretty much, I said, you need to get your fucking man before you're coming up coming hot on somebody else <laughs> because I don't give a fuck even though for me if my man was talking to another girl regardless I'm sorry the drink probably would have been thrown on the guy yeah more than any of the girls because how the fuck am I supposed to know that that's your fucking girl it, <laughs> it's your boyfriend to me I'm just shook that this guy is literally trying to get at two girls when his woman is 
on the other side of the bar, clearly well, watching. Yeah, it can't even be the other side. She How wasn't even that? on the other side of the bar. Away. So I'm just like, dudes are so disgusting. So of course, like I dip down the hall and I look back. This one is, I'm looking and she's still on the dance floor, like yelling at this chick. I'm like, oh my God. So we finally like get her. We go to the other side. They get kicked out of the bar. And then these, this other flea flicker comes up to us and they go, oh my God, are you guys okay? And we're like, yeah, like be gone. So we were dodging fleas all night, you guys, in LA. There's a lot of fleas. <laughs> Too many. Too many. We went, it was like as if we went to, you have to live here, but the bar, the JJ's. JJ's. It was like as if we went to fucking JJ's. Yeah. Which reminded me of it, and I didn't like it. <laughs> and I didn't like it. It was a like bad it. JJ's. JJ's can be fun. Yeah. To have like, you know, a little good like time. a little ghetto, ghetto fun time, and that one just, it was a no-go. Yeah, it, it was an interesting night. We had fun. Fuck rude dogs. Cause that's the fucking name of the bar. Oh, and is that what it was? Yep. Rude dogs so don't time. recommend. So that was super fun. And then basically after that, the next day you guys saw, we went to San Diego. Um, we went hiking, which was super gorgeous in Torrey Pines. I loved that. Then we went out two nights in San Diego and the last night was in Chula Vista. So basically last night we went out to Chula Vista and we just kind of bar hopped down there and it was just a really good time. So I wasn't able to really vlog cause we were like out at the bars and stuff. So I'm sorry about this being probably the shortest vlog ever. I do hope you enjoyed the little bit that I did give you guys and until next time.